What's going on YouTube? My name is Diesel and today we're in a brand new game that comes out today on Steam. It's called Winter Resort Simulator. What? Yes. Are you ready for the winter? Winter Resort Simulator lets you operate detailed Doppelmeyer cable cars and snow vehicles such as Piston Bully Snowcats set in a realistic alpine landscape. You are responsible for managing your ski resort and keeping your guests happy. Do you ski in this game? I don't think you do. I think you just manage a ski resort. It's straight simulator style, first person. Let's hop in, I'm gonna show you. Let's go ahead and play. Career, because you know, we're here to make some cash. You know what I'm saying, bro. Of course, sandbox mode we can mess around with, but let's start in the career. Halstein, Halstein money cheat. Well, let's not be cheaters. Let's not be dirty, dirty cheater cheaters. Welcome to Winter Resort Simulator. We have prepared an interactive tutorial for you, which will introduce you to the game. Do you want to play the tutorial? Yes, please. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Welcome to the Halstein Ski Resort. In this tutorial, we are going to show you the highlights and most important features in the game. Sure. I take it this is my, uh, looks like a Toyota truck. Toyota Tacoma? No. Winter Resort Simulator, you can walk around freely in first person mode. Use the keys, WASD, pretty basic, pretty standard. Time to start your first business day, let's go. All right, let's hop in this truck. Oh, walk into the truck. I feel like I'm sitting pretty low in this. Okay, WASD goes, shift gear up and down, FR for manual, parking brake B, low beam L, gotcha. By the way, in the gameplay settings, you can choose to start the car and release the engine for hurting brake yourself, it's fine. It's fine. Turn on the high beams, the low beams. The high beams, watch out, ma'am! Oh my god! All right, low beams. Interior car, exterior, oh, oh! That's quite, oh, hey, we're zooming. We're zooming. We're just zooming away, yeah. Okay, so three, four, switch to exterior, I am an exterior view. What's the, what next? What next, sir? Interior, okay, we're here. Before the resort can open at 8.30, there is still much to do. Drive the valley and follow the instructions. First off, don't... I know you're here to tell me what to do, but don't tell me what to do. Let's go. Watch out, sir. I got business to do. Oh, look at the lovely town. Whoa, whoa, sir. Sir. Jeez. No turn signals? Of course. Who might have, who might have talked crap? You know what I'm saying, bro? Turn signals? We don't use turn signals. Roads? We barely need roads. Drive to the garage, turn left at the marked spot. Okay. All right, driving to the garage. Oh, get out. Star, uh, stop at the marked spot. Okay, I will do that. We're stopping. Let's put on the parking brake. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. Turn, no, turn off the lights. There we go, now we get out. Now we get out. All right, hop in the door. Wow, wow, wee, wow, wow. Hey, buddy. Reminds me of my farming simulator days when we had our own little piston bully. Ah, oh, so nice. All right. Ah, uh, the sun, she rises and reflects off of something. That would be the window, Diesel. You're a moron. I'm aware. Pop it in here. Let's drive this jam into the garage. Lovely. Parking brake, and we out. We out here living. Let's close the garage door. It's very. It's got a lot of different buttons. I've noticed this game has a lot of different bus uh, buttons that you're gonna have to try and remember. All right, let's go ahead and open this jam up. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, nice. It's very familiar. Lift the groomer V. Hold on, let's get the exterior camera. Got the groomer. Is that? Ah, yes. Piston bully. Drive a few meters towards. Oh, okay, 25 meters. We're going forwards, we're doing it. Now what? Now what would you like me to do? The control of the piston bully is a little different compared to the control of other vehicles. The most important difference is that you have to change the driving direction by a different key. Left shift W. Yeah, yeah, I, I, it's the same as the car, bro. Just saying. Okay, L for low beams. Yeah, 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 yeah pretty much. What next? Home for beacon? Oh, we got beacon lights, y'all. Beep, 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 beep. Work light on, hit the four on the keypad. Beautiful, we got our work lights in the front. And five. We got our booty lights, y'all. That's really, that's really what we have to accentuate, to be honest with you. All right, drive the slope, we will start the grooming. 
Must groom the ski way. The ski way? The slopes. That's, we like groom the slopes for all the skiers, bro. Alright, lower the groomer with the V key. Oh, look at this! Okay. Groom the red trim part of the slope. Number three. Zero percent Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Whoa, whoa. This is touchy. It's touchy. Oh my goodness, it's touchy. We're getting it though. We're figuring it out. Man, watch out! Run for your life! Uh, yeah, can we just back this up here a smidge? A hint, a tad? Oh, okay, so we put it in reverse, it lifts the groomer up. We don't need to worry about hitting the V button when we're going in reverse. That's handy and crafty to know. We are 4% done. Let's say we do the border first, bro. Let's go ahead and do the border first, and then we'll, we'll fill it in. Alright. Up to the, it's not exactly the top of the mountain, top of the mountain, king of the castle, king of the castle. So let's go ahead and we'll turn it around. Everyone put your hands up in the air. Woo, we're going to be going down the slopes. Yeah, yeah. You can now skip this task by pressing Q if you want to. We will then continue with the next step in this tutorial. I mean, we are 18% done. We get the gist, right? So we just, we got to, we got to groom this mountain. Get it nice and pretty for all the skiers to come down. I get it. Okay. It's the most basic thing. It's so basic. It's going to be probably my favorite thing in this whole game, to be honest with you. It might be. If I can't ski myself. Oh, and everything's... Okay, I was just checking to see, like, does it stay? It doesn't look like it stays groomed, and then, uh... Looks like it does. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what. We kind of get the gist of this, right? Just go over all the stuff. Make sure it looks nice and pretty. I understand. So let's hit Q. And we'll finish this tuto just for tutorial purposes. Yeah. Drive the piston bully back to the garage. Don't forget to lift the groomer when leaving the slopes. All right. So let's lift the groomer. Hit the V. Beautiful. We're awesome. Let's go ahead and we'll turn the work light, the booty light off, unfortunately. Can't, we gotta, we gotta drop the shine on our booty. And let's back this John up here. Maybe I should put the booty light on, you know what I'm saying, bro? Let's turn off the front light, though. Beep. 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 Beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. Beep. Beep, beep. Beep. Stop. Stop. Stop! Let's turn off the home light. Beacon light. Beacon! And parking brake. And we out. Close gate. Don't tell me what to do. Let's open that one for our truck. And we'll close this one so that no burglars get in. Hopefully it's locked. I just walked right in. I don't think I have a key. Alright. We're back in this John up here. We'll drive out to this point. Beautiful. Uh, instead of going through the door, it's Indiana Jones's. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, ah! Don't do that, kids. Don't do that at home. I'm a professional stunt double. Professional stunt guy. If you don't believe me, give me a little time. All right. Pick up delivery. Park backwards at the marked spot. Park backwards. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. This car, this truck sounds like a, this is what the cyber truck sounds like. Let's go forward. It's just weird when you pop it in reverse, which is shift and then the W key pops it in reverse and then puts it into gear again. And then to go backwards. I understand it. I get it. It's just odd. Like right off the bat. To me, anyway. Because I'm a dummy. Let's go ahead and put this forward. Go forward. Move ahead. Try to accept it. It's not too late. In general, all your chalets and restaurants are delivered to automatically at 8.30 a.m. However, you can deliver them yourself in, in order to save money. I'm all about that life. I'm all about that saving money life, bro. Okay. Sometimes a facility can run out of supply. In this case, you have to deliver the facility yourself to keep it running. Okay. I hear you. Lovely shadows. Lovely shadows in this game. It's exactly how it is in real life. Uh, let's order the new delivery. Okay. 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 Let's hop over here. I'm at the spot. Press Q to place an order. Placed. Whoa. Open your car's hatch. It's a truck, not a car. 
Oh, and you click them and you hold them. Drop them. Oh, we're going to do deliveries, bro. We got chicken. Chicken delivery. Now, I have noticed that you make sure you don't bump the truck. But bump, bump the truck. Because if you do, physics get a little wonky. I don't know what's happening. Just release the box. Release the box. Fragile. This chicken must be Italian. Uh, let's go ahead and throw you in here. And last box secure. Let's go ahead and lift that hatch. Lift the, lift the hatch. Get back in the car. Now what, oh wise tutorial maker? Let's now deliver the first uh, to our first restaurant. Drive carefully and make sure you don't lose any packages. Hint, you can use exterior view key too. I'm in exterior view. Hey, see we're ahead of the curve. All right. Guess we're driving to the restaurant. Follow the road, drive carefully, and don't lose any packages. Watch out, ma'am! I'm on a delivery run! Let's roll! Drive carefully. Have you seen my videos? All right, we split off here. Oh, we're going the treacherous way. What a wonderful road to go to a restaurant. Is this the only way? Do you know the way? Yeah, apparently it's through the Alps. Just imagine being the poor sucker who has to plow this. Oh, wait, I think that poor sucker's me. Oh, good, 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 good. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'll check it out, bros. We made it. All right, we made it to the tippy top. I love it. Good, good. Oh, lights are popping on. They know we're here. Beautiful. Welcome to Dorfbound Mountain Station. This is the center of the resort, including the main Piston Bully Garage. I take it that's the Piston Bully Garage. That's where our Piston Bullies are. Beautiful. Okay. Now what? Almost there. Carefully drive past the Snow Groomer Garage to the marked spot. Oh, check it out. That's where the lifts are, dude. There's people here? I didn't see any park I didn't see any parked cars or anything, bro. I know I didn't. Excellent. You successfully delivered all the packages. No, I have not. Deliver the packages. <laughs> That's what I say. I didn't I didn't deliver anything yet. Uh, let's pop you. Oh. Good job. Oh yeah. Snow bunnies. You know what I'm saying, dudes? Ah, you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. It's all good. Let's go ahead and deliver this chicken here. By hand? Hold on. It sounds like this place is filled to the brim with people. You're not leaving any marks in the snow, ma'am. These people are made of magic. I'm terrified. Let's go ahead and grab this. Let's finish this delivery. Let's get away from these sorcerers. Last package. Dropping it right there, my friend. Let's go ahead and lift the tailgate up. All right. Hop in the car. You know, it's weird because we deliver it and then it just doesn't seem like it gives us a proper reward. Park your car in the main snow groomer garage. You got it, tiger. Uh, we'll park you here. Let me guess. Prepare the feed dwarf bun. What? A feed dwarf bun? Let's turn off the lights. Okay. Feed. What's that? At night, the carriers of detachable ropeways are parked in the stations. More precisely, in the so-called parking. This is done for both safety reasons and for protection against wind and weather. In the morning, all carriers have to be returned to the track in regular spacings. This process is called feeding. The counterpart to feeding in the morning is a so-called garaging in the evening. So feed, e feed in the morning, garage in the evening. It's like seeing a raccoon. A raccoon in the day, stay away. Raccoon at night, everything's all right. All right, let's go ahead and grab, go to the Dwarf Mount, walk to the Dwarf Mount Mountain Station. I should have my friend. <laughs> ah, Dwarf Mount. We're here? Wild. We will now feed the Dwarf Mount. Feed me, Seymour. All right, let's go to the command room. Start the system. Okay, we'll do that. Let's check out these command rooms. It's pretty wild. Ah, oh, Aziz light. All right. Okay, so there's no like you click on the console and then it gives you the console. You have to kind of zoom in and you're really kind of just eyeballing it. Okay, zoom in with the mouse wheel. Let's turn everything on. Oh, the touch screen is a particular importance of operating the ropeway. We will now use it to change operation mode to feed. Okay. And how do I do that? Oh, thank you. Parking. Open parking system menu. Done. I take it feed. 
I kind of guessed that. And then we hit the X at the top. Beautiful. Now what? What are you? What are you telling me to click? Switch the platform line. Okay. Very good. Now we have to swing the main line switch. This will enable carriers to run from parking on the track. Oh, got to go all the way out there. I can do that. Hut. Zoom in with the mouse wheel. Switch to feed. There's a lot of buttons. It's a lot of different buttons. Also, it is important to lower the platform so the carriers don't touch the ground when leaving the parking. Okay. And there's a button for that. Lower platform. Press the lower platform. I did that. Next, we have to get the parking ready. Open the gate and turn on the parking control. Okay, parking gate. Good thing you told me that was a gate. There's a door here. I just would have kept on hitting that. Uh, let's see. Basic lighting. This lighting's so basic, bro. Oh, look at you. What else? Park, parking hall light. Oh, we can, we can see now, my friends. All right, good, good, good. How many panels do we need, dog? I got a panel here. I got a panel here. I got a panel here. Hold on, another panel over here. It seems a little nutty. Dorfan, haha. <laughs> okay. Switch on parking control, move the switch to on. Okay, oh. And then, oh, we just use, um, use a mouse. Swing in, swing out. These panels are a bunch of swingers, bro. Uh, swing in, okay, so move the switch. W1 to the left. What else do you want me to do? Go to this panel over here. Switch W3 to the left. Swing in. Swing in, folks. The parking is now ready. To Let's start the ropeway. All right. Which panel do I got to use for that? This one. It's very confusing. Reset to quit all shutdowns in the parking. Okay. I'm just following the tutorial, just doing that. I don't know what I'm doing. We're learning. Press the button reset operation to quit all shutdowns on the main line. It's like, I understand it's, there's a purpose to all these. Oh my God, it's, they're moving, they're moving. Last but not least, press the button to start. Sure, let's just hit the start. Run, run! Oh. The ropeway is now accelerating, this means we can Already launched the first carrier. Okay. Immediately after that, we have to mark it to make the other station staff aware of the first carrier. Mark it. If I get clipped by a gondola, I'm going to be super aggro about it, bro. Start feeding. Feed me! Let's go! Okay. It's starting. Folks, it's starting. We're moving it. We're grooving it. Mark carrier. Boom. Good job. The first carrier has been marked. As it arrives at the other station, it will ring a warning sound to inform the station staff. Oh, we should hop on it one of these times. That'd be awesome. The rest of feeding now runs automatically for us. This is a good opportunity to do the daily inspection. Walk in the station. Oh. Watch out for the gondolas, bro. I dig it. I can dig it. Let's see what we gotta do here. Open. Open says me. Light station bridge. Okay. Oh. You know, it is nice that they have arrows, so I don't have to, like, figure it out. Open the maintenance gate. This is wild, dude. Now what? Welcome to Station D, the Doppelmayer D-Line Station. Today your task is to visually inspect the tires. Visual check. Tire conveyors. Open the covering in the station arc. Oh, look at you. Visual check spacing control. Oh, I think I missed a part of the tutorial. I think we'll be alright though. Alright. Open the covering. Every detachable ropeway is equipped with the distance control, the spacing control. Okay. 
If the spacing between two carriers becomes too small, the carrier will be stopped here until the spacing has become large enough again. Whatever that means. Oh, okay. So apparently it just taught us how to do that. Let's now have a quick look at the bull wheel. <laughs> bully, bully, and the coupling rail. This weird platform here. Watch out. Goes in. Don't put your don't put your hand in there. Don't put your hand in there. Don't put your hand in there. Alright, we inspected it. And now we gotta climb over here and inspect the railing. Okay. Here at the coupling point, the carriers are attached to the rope. Safety is crucial here. I understand. The inspection is completed. You have to wait until the first carrier arrives back here. And now we wait. I'll tell you what, man, there's a lot of gondolas. This mountain range must be huge. It's a huge, it's a huge mountain range. Hey, look, everybody, another panel. Wow. I, uh, I'm impressed. Well, that looks good. <laughs> Why, thank you. There's nothing more to do until the first carrier arrives back here. Day 169. Our first gondola has come back. First carrier has just arrived. Please now go to the control point. Close the feeding switch. I don't know where the control point is. Okay, okay. So we, we load all of them on there first. Right. Emergency stop. All right, we've emergency stopped. As soon as the ropeway is stopped, we can switch back to normal operations. I think everything stopped. There's, there's zero sound. Switch circulation. Press the, uh, the button switch circulation to swing out the switch. And then we lift the platform. Now what? Move the switch control to zero. Oh, at a different panel. It's very, it's very odd. Zero. Okay, so we, we stop feeding everything. Now we're turning off the lights to everything. Well done. Now close the gate and go back to the command room. Alrighty. Alright, click the button parking. Will do. And then feed to disable the feeding mode. Okay, okay. Seems pretty basic. Very good. The next step is to set the other station to staffed. We have to call the operator for that. Where's the phone? Oh, right there. Okay, click the log in station. Hey, they, everyone's giving us a thumbs up. I like it. System is still in service mode. No guests may be transported in the operation mode. That's the reason why we'll now enable passenger operation. Okay, how do we do that? Show me. Passenger mode. Seems pretty, pretty cut and dry. Almost done. It's time to start the ropeway. All right, all right. I'm, I'm, I'm for it. All right, pr press the button reset operation to quit all shutdowns on the main line. Uh, take it, we hit the start button. Oh my God. As soon as the operator at the other station has pressed start as well, the ropeway will begin to move. And we're here, baby, we're operating. You should consider operating the ropeway at full speed only if you really need it. This way you can save a lot of costs. Hold on. Let's crank it up, baby. Crank it up. Ludicrous speed. You may not forget to prepare the entranceway for the passenger mode. You may not forget to prepare the entrance. We may not or we may. We shall, we shan. Area for the passenger mode. Okay. to on platform separation to one the guests are now allowed to enter the entrance way all right okay we're in business now congratulations you have successfully completed feeding the, the van hey <laughs> you have finished the introductory tutorial new vehicles ropeways and much more await you press escape to get to know the rest of the game's features have fun <laughs> oh look at that we have prepared five hints for you which would be helpful for your career. Thank you. Now we're just waiting for people. 
We got the whole gondola experience down. I got gondolas, bro. Now here's the one part. I don't know how to shut it down. So uh, anybody who may get stuck on here, God help you. <laughs> uh, all right. Good, good, good. Well, folks, that is going to be episode for today. We're just starting on this uh, brand new game. It comes out today. I believe 11 o'clock Eastern Standard Time, 12 o'clock. I'm not quite sure. I'm not the developer. I have no idea. I kind of want to see what happens with the rest of it. I want to go in the gondolas. Can we go in the gondolas? <gasps> we can go in the gondolas. Hold on. Hold on. Hold up. Hee We can go in the gondolas. I want to see this mountain and all its and all its glory. It's now 8:30. First guest will arrive soon. Well, don't care. I don't care cuz I'm going down the mountain. Going down Coming down the mountain. Ba da 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 It's actually quite peaceful if you're by yourself. Anytime I go skiing, I usually have a uh, don't do this uh, at home kids or, or do. I don't know. It's up to you. I usually have a flask with me, and this is usually when me and my boys just start passing around the flask or a camel pack that's filled with whiskey of some sort, of some, of some kind. It's usually on the ski lift. It's not this fancy. I'm in Pennsylvania. It's uh, usually the two or three person ski lift, so we are sitting on our sitting by ourselves and got about a good two to three minute jaunt down the mountain and we just pass the flask back and forth look at this though this is pretty awesome this part always freaked me out because it goes kong 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 going through those towers oh how does that go again kong 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 it's an exact sound uh i've memory ticked perfectly i'm a great impersonator but folks that is going to be our episode for today it's wild. Winter Resort Simulator comes out today. Snag it up. I'm not sure what the price is. They have not given me that information, but this is pretty wild, man. It's definitely very simulator-ish. I was kind of expecting it to be more of a tycoon game, which I believe it kind of is, but I like it. I like it a lot. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Uh, I realize I've been gone for a little bit. I've been got a one-two punch of pure sickness. And... Uh, it's uh, still still there a little bit, but it's on its way out. And I want to thank everyone for all the love and support. I'm kind of just just relaxing, man. Going down the mountain. I love it, y'all. But if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button. Helps out my channel ever so much more than you know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead and subscribe. New videos are coming out every single day, every single week, folks. Have a great day, afternoon, evening, a good night. Peace out, like shout, y'all. And I will check you out right here again in Winter Resort Simulator next time.